Hello, my name is Matt Ayton, and I'm a certified SolidWorks expert with GoEngineer. This quick tip video shows how to create a point cloud file from a SolidWorks part. This requires a license of SolidWorks Premium, as it involves the scan to 3D tools. Creating a point cloud requires two separate save operations. First, I'll save this part as an STL file. In this preview, each intersection in the lattice will be a point in the point cloud. Now I open that STL file with the mesh file type option. And save this file as a point cloud file. To view the results, I'll open the file with the Point Cloud File Type option. You get the best results with curvy, freeform shapes like this. You might employ this technique if you need reference data to compare with your 3D scan data, or if you want Point Cloud files to practice with SolidWorks reverse engineering tools. This has been Matt Ayton with GoEngineer. Thanks for watching.